I am going to learn how to pick a lock with a paper clip. I bought lock picking set and a few transparent locks. Today I'll try to open this type of padlock. Before picking any type of lock, you have to understand how this type of lock works. Padlock has seven pins inside and the lock cylinder. All of them have different length. When we put key inside, all pins are removed to needed distance and we get a needed shear line and after that we can rotate a lock cylinder and the lock will open. So the main idea of lock picking is do some little tension using a tension tool and at the same time try to put pins in the right position using a picking tool. If you don't have any experience you will pick pins randomly again and again until you will get it right. But as long as you practice, you will start to feel and hear the right position of pins. Let's do it! What? I don't understand why this one is so easy. Ok, let's try with a, a real lock. I have two more locks. This lock I used many many times. I crossed so many countries in Asia. I used this padlock for locking my backpack or locker in the hostels. The key is pretty small. I see pins. This wrench tool feels too big. I expected that this lock will be really easy, but let's try this one. Open. One more time. Done. Few seconds. Few seconds. What the hell? Figured out that I don't need the second tool. It is possible to open this type of lock only with one tool. You see? It is possible. Let's try to open this lock also with only one tool. The idea is kinda push and turn at the same time, like slightly. I hope you see it. I hope you see it. <sighs> this lock gave me really good lesson. Sometimes some locks looks easy and cheap, but too difficult to open. This key from this lock and this key is from my apartment. Exactly the same type of keys. If I will be able to open this lock, I will try to pick a lock of my apartment. Let's try. You see? Open! This is a key from my apartment. This is a key from my bathroom in my apartment. The same type of the keys. I'll try to open my bathroom. I don't want my neighbors see me outside of my apartment with a toolkit and trying to open my apartment. It looks suspicious. Let's try just open my bathroom. That will be enough. Oh, 
open. Let's try with a paper clip. Probably my paper clips are too small, but let's check. One of them bend out straight and after that bend in, in half. Put this paper clip inside and bend it like that. We get attaching tool. This tool we will use for picking pins. It is possible. Yesterday I broke too many like this and today I bought a big one. I hope it will help. Done. You see? Done. Just look at this key, how difficult it looks to them paper clips. I am really cool. This is the most impressive and useful skill I ever learned. It, it feels cool. It is like spy skill. Any lock is not abstraction anymore. I just need to spend few minutes tens of minutes, maybe a few hours, but I can go through most of locks. It feels strange. For sure, I don't feel anymore secure, because I know anybody after a few hours of practice can open door to my apartment with a couple of paper clips. It's, it's crazy. Share this video with your friends. Everybody should understand how unsecure locks are. Like and subscribe. Next week, new skill.